Welcome to Harmony of Buku. There's also another game called Adventures of Baki, but don't get that game. Get Buku instead. Developed by DiMartino Entertainment. This game is kind of reminiscent of Zelda in its own way. This game is something that... Yes, I will erase my life. We're going to be starting a new game here. I was actually doing pretty good at this game. Could have showed you the intro. Really wasn't important though. <clears throat> the gameplay is where it's at. So let's go with the first round. Clef. <clears throat> so it's kind of like a weird, uh, I don't know how to explain this game. It's, it's kind of like a Banjo Kazooie clone. In a way, it's hard to explain this game whatsoever. It's very difficult. This game is something that you just. Watch out right here because you can't actually fall into the water, so make sure you don't do that. Those are checkpoint boxes. Do not touch these boxes whatsoever. Obviously, they have skulls on them. They're dangerous as fuck. You touch them, you're pretty much going to die. Like, I think there's, like, a sudden deaths. There you go. Certain way you have to hit certain enemies. A lot of them do a lot of damage to you. Um, so your health meter is those um, little red um, music notes in the top part right there. Uh, we're going to take this one time. It's going to lead us to a low key hack. Oh wow, the camera angle. Camera angle threw me the fuck off there. Alright, so we gotta start all the way back at the checkpoint. There you go. We're gonna retry this again. This time we're not gonna die. It's just sometimes camera angles get a little bit awkward. So you kind of sometimes have to refigure. <clears throat> I mean, the game does a good job of refiguring itself. But just sometimes it doesn't work. I think later on we get to uh, learn how to use our um, our shield, but that isn't until later on in the game. Alrighty, on to the next level. It's gonna be fairly short. It's kind of gonna be like some type of speed run. I'm kind of attempting. So they use a lot of repetitive repetitiveness in this game. So this may look like the same level, but I assure you it is not. Looks can be deceiving. One thing you'll notice different is um Okay, wait. This is the same level actually. But yeah, no, still, some of the levels kind of look the same in this game.
Go lay down, Sour. Go lay down. Go lay down. No, go lay down. Now, before I hurt you. There you go. Okay, I don't think I missed anything. Bye. Yadi, get out of here. Bye. Yes, and we got the pressure fire on us. Sorry about that, my little niece is kind of annoying. She likes to bug me a lot. We kind of play around a lot. I have to say things like I'm going to uh, hurt her in order for her to leave me the fuck alone sometimes. Even though I'll never hurt my niece. Sometimes you just gotta kind of trick people with aggressiveness, but don't actually use it. Being aggressive has to do with more with physical, but uh, you can be aggressive without having to be physically. Um, All right, so here we go. We have like a little temp around here. Wow, is that guy ugly? And that is GG for that part. Like I said, camera angles are weird in these games. Fuck. And sometimes you can't uh, switch the camera angle. Sometimes it's just, it. it's like automatic sometimes. I so did not mean to do that. <sighs> Alright. Really they didn't switch the camera angle so fast. God damn it. It really doesn't matter because I got uh I got the box. That's all that matters right now. I was about to go that way too and I realized nope, I've I've played this game before and I know that I've died multiple times trying to go that way. You fucked my friend. Harmony of Buku. And that's how it's done, baby. We did it, bitches. <laughs> Level 3 complete. That was kind of hard compared to the other two. It did take a lot more uh, effort. I did get my ass beat for a little bit there. But it is all Gucci. Because we got the final boss here. All right, so Clef isn't really, um, oh, the Woodwhacker.
Okay. <clears throat> Let me see if I remember how to beat this guy. Gotti. So this guy really isn't that easy. You just gotta know his combos. And then when he gets out of the cage, you gotta kind of direct him back into it. I fucked up. That wasn't the right cage. I'm just now noticing that. What the fuck? Yo, the game legit lagged. Woodwalker and shit. <clears throat> right, let's do this one more time. Okay. Just concentrating a little. Maybe, remember, this game was made by a German um, engineer, developer, whatever. Dio Martino. I don't know what actually where he is. Pretty sure he's Spanish. Um, fucking yeah, there's no way in hell he caught me. This game is unfair, and sometimes for a platformer, it can be pretty unfair. Action platformer. But this game really wasn't meant to be balanced. I mean, there is uh, some bugs and fixes every now and then, and updates on the newest, the newest update and the newest issue. It kind of got a little bit different, I guess. I don't even know. See, the the hit detection in this game is kind of off. This game, is, to me, is very reminiscent of Zelda. I fucks with it. Getting a little bit of lag here. Zaguchi. Woodwhacker can woodwhack these nuts. You ain't get some shits from me, fam. One more hit and I am dead. Okay, I need to move. Oh. I punish Woodwhacker. How about that? <laughs> this guy's armor and swords and weapons aren't pretty useful, really. They aren't really good looking, to be honest. I feel like this game was made in like a few days or so. <sighs> but it's alright, because I got this. <sighs> Take a look around. These are the ones that we just did behind us. We have these ones over here that are locked. That's four and five. Um, these ones over here. We also have this part over here. We have Hohora socks, the sandbox version. 
You can just go around and do whatever you want. Let's take a look at the shop here. We're going to unlock the Vino mode. Um, sandbox mode, I really prefer not to do this, but whatever. We'll check it out. Let you guys check it out one time. So you can basically create all types of maps and shit like that. Um, but let's go back. Maybe do that some other time. It's a pretty neat feature how they add that in there, but it's really not important right now because there's so much other shit we could be doing. Alrighty, Clef. Let's see what you can do. Clefton Buku. Clef Buku. I do love this level. Oops, I fucked up. Alright, I'm gonna have to kill myself one time. The insta death bomb. I forgot about that one time. It's been so long, like I said, since I played this game, so don't. Do not judge me. Almost forgot about this secret as well. Oh my god, I cannot get that right. For the fucking love of me. Get out of here. Come on, you can't like glitch so hard like that. Like, fuck. I mean, I'm glad I don't lose my money from those the chests, but still. I can make that jump if the game didn't lag so much. Are you kidding me? Fuck you. Your broken camera angles. I did that to myself. Alrighty. Fuck it.
I hope you guys enjoyed uh, Adventure or Harmony of Buku. This game is actually pretty good. Um, this was really just for nostalgia gaming purposes. Um, yeah, it's been a while since I've done some nostalgia gaming, so I decided I would do this. And I am done dying here, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys have, make sure to like, subscribe, give us some feedback. As always, fans, till next time, bye bye. Okay, I can't backtrack. Whatever.